Hey guys, it's spring and I wanted to just share with you something that um, may help you with whatever your goals are. Uh, it's called Faith First and it's an acronym. So the F-A-I-T-H and F-I-R-S-T, Faith First. And uh, the first F obviously is gonna stand for faith. Okay, so whatever it is that you're going after, you have to have faith, you have to have a belief that this is going to happen for you, or that you can make it happen, that everything is figure outable, and that as long as you're going in the right direction, that things are going to work for you, and for whatever your, um, whatever your, whatever your goal is, okay, as long as you keep going in the right direction, things are going to be fine, um, and then A is for your attention, because Whatever it is that you happen to be going after, you have to have deliberate attention for this. You have to look out and watch for things that are going to come in. These little signs that if you're not paying attention, you're going to miss them. And then um, the other one is tenacity. So you have to be able to like really go after whatever it is that, that is in your heart, that is in your soul, that is in your dreams. You have to not let things, you know, if things do knock you down, you've got to be able to pick yourself up and just continue to go after these things. Uh, just with all that, all that's within you, you've got to go after them, even in the toughest of times. And that goes to the H, uh, where you have to have your heart into it because you're going to come across people. And the more that you go after something and the bigger your dream is, the more you're going to come across people who are going to tell you that you can't do it or that it's not for you or that you're not qualified or whatever, whatever thing that you can possibly think of right now for whatever people are going to tell you why you can't do something. They're going to tell you these things and you have to know, you know, it's got to be in your heart uh, to just not give up on these. And then the next, the next one for first is the first F in first is foundation. So before you start going all like gung ho crazy uh, with your <laughs> with your your tenacity, make sure that you have a solid foundation. Do your research, okay? Talk to people, reach out and see. You know, okay, so where do I start? Um, they're gonna give you some good ideas, okay? And I know this firsthand. Um, I just spoke with somebody else today, and I was like, well, have you done this? And they were like, wait, what? So you have to have your foundation, okay? And then I is for ideas. So you have to be open for new ideas or open to new ideas, okay? Because as you go along, things, people saw this with COVID left and right where people had to pivot and they had to figure out new things. And so you have to be able to be coachable and to be open to those new ideas, okay? Because things are going to change as time change. It's one of the wonderful things and most difficult things for people to deal with is the change. And then for the R, we're going to go with, with relationships. Okay. So you need to talk with people. You need to find whatever common ground that you have with others who are going after the same things or similar things and build those person to person relationships. Okay. There are some things that can be done online. True. Uh, but you know, scientific studies and research shows that the best relationships are person to person uh, there's actual chemical uh, hormones and whatever that are exchanged when you are actually in close pros proximity with somebody versus, say, like a Zoom call or uh, a Google Meetup kind of thing. Okay, you have to have those relationships and you have to put effort into those relationships, whatever kind they are. You're going to have to not wait for people to come to you. You're going to have to reach out to them. And sometimes it may seem like you have to reach out to them more times than they reach out to you that's relationships, uh, but you're going to have to do those kind of things. Uh, S is for strategy. So once you have your foundation, your idea, your relationships, make sure that you've got a great strategy. Make sure you know where you're going. You know, you can't just like follow some stepping stones into a wooded forest, if you will, without a map. Have the map before you go into the forest, as they say. And then the last letter is T, and that is for time, okay? It's not going to happen overnight. Um, I know that sh people are used to seeing these influencers on social media who they're like, oh, I made this much whatever money in this very little time. 
it's not going to be sustainable. Okay. That kind of thing doesn't happen. Anything that is worth anything is going to take some time. And oftentimes it takes a lot of time put in up front. Uh, it's, it's, it's a currency, stress currency, <laughs> time currency. Uh, you have to put that up front and that's when you can actually expect to, to get something back from it. All right. I hope that has helped you in some way. Uh, until later on, please take care of yourself. Take care of each other. I love you guys. Bye.